Hi, my name is Edward and I work for the Youth Gambling Awareness Program, or YGAP for short, here in the Kingston area. Yay, it's finally the weekend. I'm so excited. You know what that means? The arcade. I can't wait to play all the new games. Let's go in and check out the new machines. Hmm, which one should we play first? Well, what about the claw machine by the corner? It looks so much fun with the flashing lights and oh my goodness, the ringtone is so catchy. Yeah, and I really like the dolphin plushie. I feel like I'm gonna win it. You think so? Okay, let's see. Aw oh, man, I lost, but was so close. I'm gonna try again. Well, I didn't get the toy I wanted, but hey, at least I got something, a new fidget spinner. That's pretty cool. I'm really glad you won, but how much would you have paid for that fidget spinner if you saw it at the store? Hmm, I don't know, a dollar, two dollars? Hmm, and how many rounds of this game did you have to play before you got the spinner? Well, I think eight, and each turn costs two dollars to play. So that's $16 for a toy that you would have paid either a dollar or two for. This seems a lot like gambling. You're playing a game, risking your money on a chance to win something. It is gambling, actually. These games can be lots of fun. Just remember that you never know what you will get. It might be something great, might be something worth very little, or something that's worth nothing at all. It was fun, and that is the best way to look at it. Hope to win, but expect to lose. Just enjoy the game. If I really want the item, it is probably best to just go to the store and buy it. Also, it's really easy to lose track of time and spend more money than you mean to when you're playing these games. Yeah, you guys are right. I wanted to play ski ball today too, but I've already spent all my money. Well, next time, let's make a plan before we start playing. We can decide how long we want to play stay in the arcade, how much money we want to spend, and how many games we want to play. Yeah, that's a really great idea. I'm going to try that when I play video games too. I can set time limits and decide how much money I want to spend on loot crates before I start to play. I'm going to try that too. Sometimes I play video games for so long that I don't have time to do my homework. I've even missed basketball practice because I've gotten so caught up in gaming. And try setting those limits and see if that helps. If you do continue to struggle, you can always reach out for help. The kids' help phone is a good place for that. You can call for free and it's totally confidential. You can actually call them about anything at all. That's really cool. What's the number? It's one 800 668 Six eight six eight. Hey, thanks. Do you guys want to go play basketball at the park now? Absolutely. Let's go.